And Defar leading, here's the first big push from Defar, it's not decisive and Melkimu still trying to go with it, the two Kenyans look a little bit spent now, so Defar kicking for the gold medal, looks behind her, sees her teammate Melkimu just a stride and a half behind and Melkimu starting to attack on the outside but Defar finds a little bit extra, but this is going to be tight, Defar running and here comes Lynette Masai finishing quickly, Melkimu's going to get this though, is it Masai? Masai's coming, it could be Kenya's! Kenya take the goal! Longo, uh, Boucher in trouble, Borzakowski, Kipkata leaves it late, Longo leads, Schumann gets out at the right time, Longo's a stride up as they enter the straight from Boucher, Schumann, Kipkata late, Borzakowski, Syed Gurney late and Saping, Kipkata with a flashing run, Syed Gurney out wide, Schumann's taken the lead, will Kipkata get to him? Schumann's just in front, Kipkata won't get him, Schumann's won it! Turgut may well have left it too late. The Ethiopian is the fastest sprinter, we believe, if he's fit. And Turgut now is uh, really having a go. This is where we find out. And Turgut's holding him. And Gabriel Selassie kicks again, but Turgut is holding him. Uh, and Gabriel Selassie wins it. Turgut second, does he give their feet. Kato leads to series second, Harold is third, Morsley is beaten, it's Kato of Spain who's stolen the lead from the rest of them. Kato is going to take the most popular gold medal of the games. Kato wins it. Elvisi they have to catch Asbel Kiprop of Kenya. He has the lead as they come off the turn for home. It's Kiprop in front, career of Kenya on the inside, Lagat and Webb. And here comes Bernard Lagat. Lagat flying up on the outside. Here's Bernard Lagat wearing the American uniform for the first time at a world championship, sprinting to the line to win the gold medal. The Tonnen's there. The Gila is there. Montserrat in third place. Chogi stuck on the outside. Kiprop starting to make his move. He's following Bala. Bala looks as though he's straining. So does Lalu, but Kiprop is gliding. But has he left it too late here? Right at the front. Still leading and kicking away, and here comes Kamal. And Lagat makes a move out. Kiprop's still got miles to go. Will he get there? It's going to be Kamal stretching it out. Kamal of Bahrain has got to take the gold medal. Dips it on the line. There's Poised to strike. He's put himself in the right place. But there are real sprinters outside him. This isn't over yet. Centrovitz desperate to get a first Olympic medal. But McLoofy's coming on the outside. Asbel Kiprop's tying up. It's not going to be Kiprop's day. Centrovitz can sense glory, but McCluffy's coming. Can he hang on? Centrovitz is the only... He's a metre in front. He's so strong. Earl Garouge, we know what he did in the 1500. He might do it again. He's summoning up the strength. The gods are with him. He goes to McCainley. McCainley fights back. But Earl Garouge is going to do it. Pavo Nurmi did in 1924. He's got to go now. It's Bekele from Sehan from Vinkesha. Moses Mossop, the Kenyan thread. Bekele kicks for the first time and Sehan tries to go with him. Mossop is still there. Can he strike in the long straight? Bekele hasn't won it yet. The defending champion, the Olympic champion, goes again. One metre, two metres. He's still going strong. Bekele is going to win the world title again. Bekele defends it. Straight away. They're into the final turn. Keyshawn Al Garouge. He's been nearly unbeaten at 1500. But can he hold on to win here at the Olympics? He's getting a challenge now from Nian. Al Garouge still has the lead. Nian up to challenge him but can't get by him. Now he pulls the breath. Does Garouge have a match? He does not. Nian goes by. And no Nian of Kenya wins the gold. Al Garouge is another. Impressive in the early rounds, nearly got disqualified. Who's running away with this is the Algeria. It's uh, McLuthi who's heading for home. He's opened up a really big lead. Devin Medin is now moving to second place. Here's McLuthi. 
really well cleared this field. Manzano finishing over the train as well with Jim Athens. But it's Matt Luffy who's taken this gold medal here. He is no figure in the top. In Deku of Kenya, leading Mo Farrell, Great Britain. And the home straightaway moves. Here they come into the straight, and Deku still has the lead. Now Farrell moves to the outside to challenge. Farrell's alongside, and Mo Farrell surges to the front and starts to pull away. It's Farrell accelerating to the finish line to win the 5,000. But definitive style, the right arm where he used to carry books when he was a youngster, born in the same place as Bikili, and now the young man strikes for home. Has Gabriel Selassie got anything left? The emperor is beaten. We're going to have a new king from Ethiopia. Here he comes. Kenanisa Bikila unleashes a phenomenal sprint into the home street. Gabriel Selassie still running strong. This is a brilliant, brilliant run. It's going to be gold for Ethiopia. It goes to the young man. It goes to the youngster. It goes to the girl. Gabriel Zalesi coming. To Lewis four meters in front. Gabriel Zalesi's coming at him. There's 60 meters to go. Gabriel Zalesi comes up alongside to Nui. He is going to take him. Gabriel Zalesi goes past. And he's going to get the gold medal. Up just behind. Gabriel Zalesi has gone. My word, he's shot ahead. He's pouring it on down the top end. This is a 10,000 meter come sprinter. Look at that gap he's opening up on Carly Scar and Turga. It's 20 yards, 25 yards, soaring away from the rest of the field. And the I meant no move at all, but Castro's right with these with a lap and a half left. The other man is Mezigibu in sixth place, only 19. And there goes Gabri Selassie. Well, he doesn't need to. He didn't need to go that early, but look at that acceleration. Now the reigning champion is on his way. He can see one to go. Hear the music of the bell. Turgot's gone second. Here's your third. The Ethiopian, a lap of honor. He's won this so nicely. Turgot is closing, but he'll never catch him. So, Gabriel Salasi wins for the third time in success. Perfect position on the outside, good striking distance for this last 100, 200 meters. Stand by for the kick of Dave Waddle. If he's got it, he could make it. But he's going to catch Oshana and the Kenyans. And there he comes. This is the bid for a gold medal of Dave Waddle. He's got one Kenyan. He's going to get it, make it. Oh, uh, well clear. Right at the back is John Mayo. And Maltzley strikes for goal. And it's there for the taking now. Maltzley, world record holder, three times the world champion, becomes the Olympic champion. Come home now for what could be the eighth Kenyan success in succession in the race. It's once again is Hilke Kambai, who is one of the greatest super chasers we've ever seen. And he's adding to his reputation here as he comes through surely to win this race. But this is going to be to Kenyan sweep. But Kambai can way out into the outside lane, celebrating already. Kambai wins it.